Crazy Man 444 here and kind of gives you a little rundown, give you a little run through of the North vs. South track I've been working on, some of the changes since the last video I posted. Um, one of the changes sitting right in front of us here is mud truck. Got materials a little more fancified up, got a windshield in it. Uh, redid, gave it more, gave it the management materials section, so now I got the better chrome going on for it better shininess to it rims are shined up axles are textured or they have a texture for them now got a motor in it and everything so it's it's getting there it's still a little tinkering project here and there but uh without further ado here's the rundown through the north versus south course the first jump still sits kind of high really wasn't that high on the real track uh, shoot down here to the uh the first, first in-ground pit section, little miniature hill that this is meant to really trip you up. Swing back around here and uh, cross back over the ditch and head for the first pit, which I steepened this jump right here so you can't hit it as fast or else you will launch way too high in the air and it will be unrealistic and probably slow you down. I mean, you can clear that, but I uh, wouldn't advise hitting it that fast. I intended to do that. And you come through this pit, which I haven't really worked on this pit. It seems to be pretty fine, actually. No big issues with that one. It's a little bit deeper, a little bit harder to get through. Slow down for the, ooh, the in ground there. The ditch. Swing back around, get yourself lined up for the finish line. Still a little slick. Might be my truck, to be honest. Swing back around for the finish line. And, woo! And hopefully not damage your truck in the process. And that's pretty much the rundown of the North versus South track. Um, guess for better lack thereof, I'll do a quick little uh, run over here to this pit. The first pit you hit, just to show you how, uh, how steep that actually... What happens if you hit that going way too fast. Just so you can see what that's like. If you uh, if you come flying into this pit just right and hit that too fast, you'll uh, be in for a rude awakening. And that's what happens if you hit it too fast. While it does get you out of the pit quicker, it looks highly unrealistic, and yeah, you'd probably do some huge damage to a real life mud truck. Only did that on per mainly did that because the actual track. They none of the trucks actually hit that full bore. I think the only one I seen that actually hit that and actually cleared it was uh, the Carolina Spankinator mud truck, but that was the only one I think that I'd seen clear it. I think Son of a Digger and I think King Sling might actually cleared it. The Son of a Digger truck came close, but I don't think anybody was really trying to break their break their trucks on that jump. So uh, that's pretty much it. I will. Uh, be back later with more updates on this track as as I get further together. You can always check simmonsters.com for more updates to uh, the non monster truck project thread. Uh, and uh, let me guys post post away in the comments section. Let me know what you think of the track so far.